guys, Caleb with White Metal Games here, and today's studio update is this Tau Storm Surge in an environmental, uh, well, ironically, Storm Surge color scheme. Um, this particular client asked us to paint a Storm Surge to match a picture uh, that they found online, and essentially it was a storm cloud with um, bits of all sorts of different colors in the storm cloud, reds and yellows, oranges, and, and that sort of thing, with sort of bluish, purplish lightning strikes spread throughout. Um, and what was interesting is that one side of the storm cloud is very, very dark and brooding, while the other side of the storm cloud has a lot of light going on. So he asked us to sort of mirror that as an effect. So what we, we call this environmental painting, the idea being that it mirrors the environment that it is in. So in this case, the back of this model is very, very dark to represent the cloud whereas it transitions into this much, much, much lighter color scheme. Uh, you can see here it's kind of tilting, tilting, and then until finally we reach the front of the storm cloud, whereby all of the colors are bright and bold and vibrant uh, and just really, really pretty. Um, so you've got the, the pilots there with your little blue OSL, uh, but this color, this color is mirrored in the energy weapons, like here and here on the venting here on the shield, and then again here on the front with these lightning strikes. So it's just an evocative looking color scheme that's kind of fun. We put the model on this sort of uh, ruined uh, post-apocalyptic world base with some ruins of uh, rocks and debris and leftover machinery and that kind of stuff. So it gives it a really dynamic, um, uh, futuristic feel, which I quite like. Uh, it's also worth noting that this is a repaint. Uh, the original model came into us just layered in enamels. And um, we weren't able to strip it down, but we were able to prime over and start from fresh. And you can see that really what this boils down to is that lovingly applied you can achieve high level finishes even on rough and tumble models which i think is really just kind of great and encouraging it means you can buy stuff on ebay um, without fear of whether or not we can purpose it to a higher higher level um, we can there's obviously some ex exceptions to that but in general yeah it's a great looking great looking model great looking color scheme and um, a salvage model of all things if you would like to commission anything in the future or something even like this contact us at info at whitemetalgames.com and until next time put your minis where your mouth is